Hi guys, does this view look familiar? so excited to share this with you. We bought a house. So we're gonna take you guys in for a little tour. Follow us. Got the keys? Got the keys. Yeah, so Show us this, is, this is the kitchen. Uh, we're, obviously we're gonna be doing some renovations. And we have a bedroom. And the flooring is amazing. Here's a with view. Yeah, let's see. Wow. Yeah, it's all about the view here. I mean, this is an amazing spot, as you uh, already seen. A lot of old furniture left in here. Yeah, like I said, the lighting is going to be a little dark because there is no electricity. This is the hallway. So this is another bedroom. They all have lots of light coming through all the rooms. It's a pretty large house. It was, uh, and there's a view. Yeah, oh, nice, the back. nice view. There's a oh, Pico right Pico behind. There. Yeah, there you go. It's a bit cloudy, but nobody else behind to our just that house there. But to the other side, nobody. Very private. Actually, that's a friend of ours, Joe. Joe from Oakville. Yeah, he's from Oakville too. He was born in Oakville. So uh, this is the bathroom. Yeah, it's a good sized bathroom. Obviously, we're going to do a few renovations to the few of the areas of the house. Yeah, and we've got the living room, but we're actually going to change this room into a bedroom. There's little stairs that go downstairs, but they're very steep. So we're actually going to close this up. That's what we're thinking. Yeah. Uh, and turning this into a bedroom, yeah, this is, which is going to have its own little door. Yeah, this is one of my favorite rooms is this one. When we first saw it, well, obviously going to give you the full own story. Door and an own little, yeah, little patio that we're going to yeah. put. Look at the view here. It's just, it, here. Has, it has its separate balcony. And obviously you're going to get it. There's the vantage point. There's the other balcony where the uh, we entered from. Yeah. As you can see, it's just Atlantic Ocean all the way around. What a portrait, you and the blue ocean behind you. <laughs> <laughs> and, and then there's the... This was an addition uh, that they did to the original house. This house, I think it's about 100 years old, and they added this afterwards. This will be turned, I think, into a bedroom. It's probably the biggest. Let me just show the, uh, the window. We want to give these our followers all views, all angles, just to so you guys can understand. Here's how the ceiling is. These are wood. Probably going to open up the ceiling in most of the house if we can. That's the back area all the way up there. Look how how big these walls are. These are like solid it's rock here. Rock. So these are like obviously load bearings, so we're not going to move those, but... Uh... Yeah, so come on outside, we'll take you through the bottom part. So we're going to go out the kitchen here. This is the view. So Carlos is just opening up the door downstairs. So we have some gardening to do. It's a little uh, dark in here, but let me just open some windows up. This is the bottom part of the house. And these were the stairs that I told you about going up. And then this is another little room. 
Probably could be the laundry room or storage. Uh, or storage I think it might be storage. storage, yeah. We're still trying to figure out what... Uh, but look at this is all wood, see the wood? Mm -hmm. Nice beams. Yeah, really nice. And the walls again, you see this? Yeah, very, very thick walls. Yeah. Even so, even these rooms uh, have nice views and... Uh, Cute little window. This so is a, also part of the property. Yeah, so this is uh, not just a house. We, um, we have this whole land here, which all been uncovered. Some cows came in here. And, uh, yeah, so we have uh, our neighbor's cows. He brings them over. And so it, we have a, a natural lawnmower. And fertilizer. <laughs> and fertilizer. Just have to watch out for the cow patties. Yeah, look, it's pretty dry. Just, there's some dry areas. There's a fig tree. So where do you see the rocks? That's the barrier of the, of the, of the, the property. Now we're just going to go to the back of the house. So we have to clear all these weeds here. And this used to be an old wood oven, wood oven inside the house. So have a lime tree. We'll plant some more trees. As you can see, we have a lot of room to do an outdoor to really pump up the outdoor area. This comes around to the top where we walked in. But that's not all. We have a few other things to that's part of the whole property. One is this beautiful stone house. The original two levels this could originally could be turned into a it's heritage so you can't really do much to the outside but um, it's beautiful this could be turned into a nice luxury place and that's uh that was used to wash clothes in the old days inside there's a well there's a couple of wells here so this uh, is part of the property as well and uh, so we're kind of thinking, how would we use this uh, little building? This is an old well here, if you can hear the echo. It's a little water, actually. Yeah, so this is the other side of that wall. So we'll probably just turn this into yeah, equipment right. room, yeah, it's a good tool size. room. Perfect. And, uh, okay, so now we're going to show you the other side of this beautiful stone house. Yeah, as you can see from the outside, it's the bottom um, part of the stone house. We will, we'll show you the upper part. Here. Amazing. If you like lava, there's still some. Actually, the lighting here is actually pretty more than I thought. We haven't really. Uh, we're gonna look more in here, but as you can see, uh, they probably made a bit of wine or moonshine in here. But look but at these walls. The walls. And look, look at these beams. And this has been years. However, this is over 100 years old. Maybe 150. Maybe more. And these beams still stand up. This is, uh, we're just going to show you the upper level of the stone house, but uh, this is like, these are wells, see? And this tile is still in pretty good shape, but there's actually more tile inside than the, the lava house, if we ever need it. Yeah. Here's the lava house. Let's get a quick look. It'll be dark in here, so hopefully there's enough light. Yeah, there it is. So even this is the original floor. Obviously, you'd have to need new flooring in here. But it's beautiful. I just years ago, this is what 
they built all over the island. And this wood's been here for years. Wow. Yeah, the idea would be to turn this into a luxury rental, like a suite. Make that window even bigger, because from that side you can see the, it's just the Atlantic Ocean is on that side there. But, yeah, when we first uh, bought the house, so we were interested in the house. We just thought it was just a house. You know, when the, afterwards when the lady took us around, she then said, oh, it includes that other property and this lava house and so forth. So we're like, wow. But yeah, so this is right next to the house. We're very thrilled on this purchase. Laura's already getting to work. She just couldn't wait. <laughs> this, is, a lot to do. <laughs> this is the view from the kitchen. Can you open the door for a second? Yeah, so that's the view from and the actually, sitting what, at a kitchen table. What I was really excited about that we didn't know we had. We didn't know, yeah, another surprise. Was a half door. <laughs> you kept saying, we got to get the door that open, you know, half door, but there it is. I love these doors. <laughs> yeah, but uh, you can get this view day and night, 24 7, you can see. Yeah, so you can do work inside the kitchen. The Fridge is in good shape. We'll probably get a new stove. Uh, but here's the, uh, this is uh, looking straight in here is the, was the, the old wood oven. The whole, put the firewood, light up the fire, then cook the bread and so forth inside. And I don't know if you can see, but looking up, there's the chimney. So this is the original. So we're just going to have to try and come up with ideas. Yep. And we'll keep you posted. You on the journey with us. Here's my new buddy here. Hey, this is our neighbor. Hey, let's do a selfie. This is a, hey buddy, you like it? Oh, oh you're a good guy. Hi guys, uh, we just thought it would be appropriate for us to finish this uh, video uh, here in Laish. We're in the square and as you can see behind us, uh, it's uh, very well lit up with beautiful uh, Christmas lights. And we'll do a f another video just on Christmas and you'll, you can see other um, parts of this village and a few other areas uh, lit up for Christmas. But for now, um, we, we thought was, this was the perfect spot for it. Yeah. It was a few days before Christmas, right? So So we wanted to wish everyone a very Merry Christmas, Happy Holiday, Feliz Natal, and hope everyone has a happy and safe holiday. And hopefully 2021 is a much better year. And we also wanted to thank everyone for supporting our channel. Uh, we really, really appreciate all the comments, and uh, yeah, that's, yeah, that's you pretty much took all the words out of my mouth. <laughs> now you but can say I don't know Portuguese. what I'm gonna say. No, but we are we're gonna try and do obviously, this is the first one the series of We Bought a House in Portugal, as you will see, you've obviously seen the video. And uh, there's two, three, four, uh, maybe even more, uh, same series. And uh, obviously, you know, we just, I, you know, in Portuguese, I think I should say, uh, to the, not everybody speaks, um, someone might be watching, they don't speak English, so Feliz Natal. Para todos, todos os amigos e família aqui do Pico, uh, na América, no Canadá. Um, and, uh, até logo. Até logo, yeah, até logo. <laughs> and see you on the next video. Bye, guys. Uh, Feliz Natal.